Hello, my lovely people. I am back with another banger. Yes, 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 it's happening. Nigeria, Nigeria, who Nigeria? You know, the political climate of Nigeria looks very cloudy and very, very uncertain. What is the way out? What's the way out of it, friends? First up, Keyamu says foreign lawyers are in Nigeria to stop Tinubu's inauguration. Keyamu is the minister for labor and employ employment in our country, Nigeria. And uh, he has alleged plot by the opposition parties to legally stop the inauguration of the president-elect. Bola Ahmed Tinumbu before May 29. In a tweet on his official handle, the All Progressive Congress, APC chief team, alleged that some legal practitioners are already in Nigeria, haven't been flown to the country to do the job. So the minister, Keyamu ascribed the move and reaction it generated as illiteracy, saying some unscrupulous characters are taking advantage of those he term natalent nitwits. I don't know what he mean by that. He wrote, and I read, I read somewhere that some supposedly learned fellow is assuring the Nathaniel Nitwit that the inauguration can be legally stopped before May 29th. And yet, another story that some foreign lawyers have been flown in to achieve this purpose. And I read many excited reactions from these Nitwits. I read for them. Then I shook my head and murmured under my breath, illiteracy is truly a disease. And it is sad that some unscrupulous characters are taking advantage of these poor fellows. The president elect tribunal however had been fixed for Monday. And it will be the commencement of the hearing of the petitions filed by the opposition parties seeking to truncate the victory of Tinumbu, according to Keyamu. Meanwhile, the preparation for transition is in top gear as President Muhari, Muhammad Buhari is set to hand over power to Bola Tinumbu on May 29. This is the submission of Minister. Keyamu. Friends, what is your opinion? Do you think the last presidential election in Nigeria is free and fair? Is it selection or election? Is our mind clear about the position of things as far as politics in Nigeria is concerned? Where are we heading to? We cannot, as a nation, afford to miss it again. The promise made by this, by this administration that is going out are yet to be, to be met. Are we putting ourselves into another situation where people will find it difficult to live, can we be bold and be proud of Nigeria as a nation? There are a lot of uh, controversies, there are a lot of grievances going on as far as the election is concerned. Let's wait what will be the outcome of the election tribunal. Friends, that's where I will stop till I come your way next time with another video. Take good care of yourself. And I say, bye-bye.